Conventional radiotherapy treats cancer patients and starts the treatment off with CT and MRI scans for treatment planning. The tumor is localized and the radiation dose and irradiated areas are calculated. The major drawback in this case, the subsequent radiation only shows bone structures in the body but not the tumor itself. As a result, the radiated area is often larger than necessary. The Heidelberg University Hospital has recently started to use the MR Linac to increase the precision of radiation therapy. Der MR Linac is a combination device. This is now erstmals möglich. The MR Linac is a high field MR guided linear accelerator that combines an MRI scanner with a linear accelerator in a single system. This device allows us to take advantage of the superior soft tissue contrast of the MRI, enabling us to see the tumor and the surrounding organs more precisely. We can then better distinguish the tumor from the surrounding area and thereby limit the treatment time and radiated area. We can also, to put it simply, make a video of the patient and respond to position changes during the therapy. Während der Therapie auf Lagerungsveränderungen reagieren. Thanks to the addition of the MR Linac, the Heidelberg University Hospital now has all state-of-the-art radiation therapy equipment and methods available on site. Whether a patient receives MR Linac radiation therapy largely depends on whether this treatment promises to offer the most benefits for him or her. Patienten profitieren von dieser Behandlung, ähm, vor allem Patienten mit Tumoren. Patients with tumors in the abdomen or in the lungs, which can move with each breath, benefit most from this treatment. A tumor's position can also change in hollow organs such as the stomach, small intestines or the bladder due to their changing contents. Now we can see the tumor's movement more precisely, allowing us to be more accurate in radiating the area where the tumor sits without the need for an added radiation dose to the surrounding area. Different disciplines must work together to ensure the performance and functionality of the MR Linac device and warrant optimal therapy for patients. This includes the computer scientists who handle all the computer technology, the physicists who handle radiation treatment planning for us and who face new challenges thanks to new measurement techniques, and of course physicians like me who treat the patients. Medical physics is tasked with meeting the comprehensive technical requirements that go along with the application and improvement of this device. The particular technical challenge is the development of the actual hybrid MR Linac radiotherapy device, that is the integration of the advanced linear accelerator for radiotherapy and the MRI system for imaging. To ensure beam delivery, the linear accelerator must work in the magnetic field of the MRI, while the MRI scanner must in turn not be affected by the beam generating components of the accelerator. The unique challenge for medical physicists is that we must adapt our conventional measurement equipment and techniques to the special features of the MR Linac. For example, the measurement detectors that we use for dose measuring must also work in the magnetic field of the MRI, prompting us to make adjustments to the measurement methodology if necessary. The MR Linac combines radiation and MR imaging. This facilitates a treatment without additional radiation exposure. Imaging data can be obtained on a daily basis, which increases radiation therapy precision and further lowers the risk of side effects. However, needless to say, it takes a lot of time and manpower if you have to create a custom plan for the patient and adapt to individual changes every day. That's one of the drawbacks. What's more, only patients who are MRI compatible can receive radiation therapy with the MR Linac. Unfortunately, this means that patients with pacemakers can currently not be treated with this particular device. However, these are only a few minor drawbacks compared to the major advantages and the vast potential of this therapy. And this potential of the MR Linac device is that it will change the current standard of care in radiation therapy over the next few years. Ongoing clinical trials are designed to find out which patients will benefit the most from this device.